those three years are devoted to building those parts of your application. Remember, it's a marathon. Uh, and the rest of this now that we're gonna talk about is the sprint. If your grades aren't solid across the board, an upward trajectory is best. Uh, you know, it shows you've been working towards self-improvement, towards bettering yourself. And again, that's something that you can explain in the optional essay as well. You know, you want to have some kind of position in, the, in an organization you're a part of, president, captain, chair, whatever. It's, it's awesome, but it's not a necessity. You know, a strong commitment is a necessity. A leadership is just sort of, you know, icing on the cake. Gentle reminders are important. You don't want to be annoying, but you want to every two to three weeks, just a gentle reminder. Hey, you know, just want to let you know. Uh, I wanted to see how you, my recommendation was coming along. The deadline is November 1st, whatever, like, and, and um, you know, how, how's it going with that? My biggest piece of advice is time is your friend. You know, leave time between drafts. It, it helps to let him breathe a little bit. Put it down, come back to them with fresh eyes. You know, you also be able to multitask. You need to be able to work on your Harvard essays and then put them aside to work on your Duke essays. So multitasking is important and leaving yourself time is, is the best way to multitask effectively.